Hey guys, Stargazer1331 back once again, bringing you part four of the um, uh, of my playthrough of uh, Crash Crash Bandicoot Insanity. This time, it's gonna be Iceberg Lab. This is when the game starts to get really good. This is this is this is my second favorite section of the game. My first favorite, my favorite being the Academy of Evil, but this is my second favorite part of the game coming up here. I hate to say, but my least favorite part has to be the very end of the game. I don't know, I don't really have been, I don't know, it's a tough call. I mean, I think the ending is a little bit better than the beginning. Okay, because you, you, you kindly shut up now. It's taking unusually long, man. There we go. Yeah, that music was messing up the freaking boat. That is just bad. I've never seen the boat get messed up that freaking badly, dude. I mean, seriously. Yeah, sorry the snow looks a little bit bright just in the way I, the setting I have. Before you rise is a cathedral of diabolical genius. Scary. But in the wrong hands, this iceberg lair could do much goodness in the world. Of course, only I have the key. Oh, this is great. Absurd. <laughs> Follow me. I know another, another way. way. Yeah, now we're not gonna follow Cortex just yet, cause we're, we're gonna go gem hunting. You, you can actually get a lot of gems just in just in this place alone, but like just in this one section. Yeah, my freaking analog is screwed up again too. But like, if, if I try to turn it to too far an angle, Crash won't move at full speed. He'll, he'll just walk slowly, which is freaking annoying. I hate that treads. Oh my god! Like, just look at, look at how risky this is. Oh, whoops, it was behind them. My bad. It's funny, because I think I actually did manage to actually get through there without hitting the crate somehow. I don't know, I, I don't know. It doesn't look like you did that, though. Alright, so, alright, now, now, now I know where, now I remember where that crate went. What? Oh, man, this music isn't screwing up either. Like, this is, this is, like, this is another song that I would love to, that I would love to hear how it would sound like this song. But, but no, no, just, just no. Oh, that's why it is. Like, what? Oh, yeah. There we go. Much, much of it. Gem number one. Yeah, yeah, definitely plenty of gems to get here. So the first one is there, which is a pretty easy one to do. You, you, you just gotta watch your step. Next, the next gem is coming up down down below, down down there actually. Which this one again, you just you just mainly you mainly just gotta watch your step. Good. That bounce crazy right up there. There we go. That's awesome. There we go. Yeah, that, yeah, that all does with that gem. And then there's, there's there's another one down below too. At least I thought there was. Yeah, there definitely is. Yeah, here we go. Uh, where did that, where did that, oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, yeah, down there. But that is a cool one, if, if I'm not mistaken. Oof. Yeah. There we go. Yep, so yeah, so that's how you get the blue gem. Next, the purple gem on this one, I believe. Yeah, here we go. And then the, I think the yellow gem is bent back over to the left. Yeah, 
Oh, uh, okay, I didn't even look like I was standing on the freaking crate. That's pretty hilarious, actually. There we go. There you go. Sweet deal. without even going to a regular level, where it is, I hate it, dude, because the Academy of Evil, you can almost do that, because you, you literally get all but one in the, in the, uh, the Academy of Evil. Oh, yeah, then the LGM, you gotta, yeah, yeah, you gotta go further over. Fans are awfully close to crash. I don't, I don't think they can kill you, they just, they just, um, push your backwards, I believe, and we need to go into those things. So those chains are freaking huge. Yeah, 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 sorry we're going off on a bit of a tangent there, but, um, yeah, this part is a teeny bit on the boring side. Yeah, but believe me, I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna just call this apart, because, um, well, not, well, as soon as I get the gen, that'll, that'll be it for this part. Yeah, and that's, that's it for the gems already in the Iceberg Lab, so yeah, so that, I really can call that a part of things, because the Iceberg Lab is done. <laughs> well, so with that said, let me, uh, let, let me situate myself in, in, into, into the Ice Climb, and then that'll be it, and that'll be it for this part. Yep, so then just fly along this path here, and you'll eventually end up in it. And you can tell that you'll win the level because the scenery will change slightly. Yep, that's it, yep. Yeah, and there's Ice Climb. Well, also with that said, I um, uh, ho hope you enjoyed this little part here, and that said, stay tuned for part 5, which will be the Ice Climb.